Hey y'all, welcome back to another week in the Story Behind series. Today I'm going to talk to you about a song called Cowboy Boots. As many of you know, I'm a southern girl and I have a lot of cowboy boots. I own eight pairs. And when I was a sophomore in college, I wrote this song. But I only wrote the lyrics. I didn't put any music to it and I just kept it on my phone forever. I really just couldn't figure out what kind of style I wanted, the chord progression or the pattern. So it was just lyrics sitting on my phone for years. And I remember telling Frank about this song and we went out to dinner with his aunt and he was bragging about this cowboy boots song that I had written. His aunt wanted to hear the song, but I was embarrassed because I didn't have any music to it. And so I kind of felt like a failure when it came to this music because this song wasn't going anywhere. Well, here came the opportunity that I needed, the kind of kick in the booty to get this song from uh, lyrics to music. I decided I was going to finally put music to Cowboy Boots and about the second time I was going into the recording studio was when we were going to lay down the track for this song. I remember being a little nervous because I had just recently put the music to it and was just hoping that it was going to sound good. Well, Todd made me feel really comfortable, so I put the track down and we decided right then and there, hey, we got to put the vocal tracks to this. So we laid down the lead track and I was just feeling more and more confident as the day went on and the time went on because I, I realized that, hey, this song that's been sitting on my phone for five years is finally being brought to life. And then I had this great idea to bring in my guitar teacher and friend, Matt Nelms, and he did such an amazing job on this song. He did acoustic guitar and mandolin and that just really made the song go from, you know, a nice little tune to something really cool and catchy. I loved every single thing that he did. I mean, Todd and I would just sit and be mesmerized by Matt's talent. Make sure you listen for that mandolin part because it's just phenomenal. As time went on, Todd added extra instruments. I did the percussion, um, the shakers and the tambourines and added background vocals. Just because I had this song sitting on my phone for five years didn't mean that that was for a waste. This song needed time for me to get a little more creative so that by the time it was ready to release, it would be perfect. And that's the story behind cowboy boots. If you don't own a pair of cowboy boots, I highly encourage you to buy one or two or eight like me. Also, if you don't have a copy of my More Than You Know album, please contact me because I would love to get a copy in your hands so that you can experience the great joy that I do when I hear it. Thanks so much for watching. Make sure to follow me on Instagram, YouTube, and Facebook at Sarah Nicole Musician. I'll see y'all next week for another Story Behind video.